Let's simplify the fraction 25 55 Here's how you do it. We want to find another fraction that's equal to 25 divided by 55, what we call an equivalent fraction. It has the same value. It's just that we put it in its lowest terms. Now to do that, what we need to do is find a common factor, something that goes into 25 and 55. So here are the factors for 25 and 55. So when I look at the factors for 25 and 55, the greatest common factor, that's going to be 5. So I'll divide 25 by 5 and then 55 by 5, and we'll have simplified 25 over 55. Let's move these over here. So 25 divided by 5, that equals 5. And then 55 divided by 5, that equals 11. So we've simplified 25 55 down to 5 11 and we can't reduce or simplify this any further. These are equivalent fractions. 5 divided by 11 and 25 divided by 55, you get the same number. It's just that we've simplified 25 55 down to 5 11 This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.